Hey guys, Mist here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video I'm gonna talk about our new upcoming hero Diadia. In China server her name is Xiao Si Yuan but in global her name will be Diadia. She is estimated to come mid-September. Diadia is a support hero with very unique abilities. She can heal teammates, has crowd control and most importantly she can steal golds from enemies. So, today let's learn about her abilities and be prepared before her release in global. Passive, Chanting. Every 7.5 seconds Diadia fills the white stack bar, which makes her next basic attack enhanced. When she uses it, she swings at enemy, dealing spell damage and knocks them back, while she herself jumps back. You can also use this to go through walls. You don't need any targets to use her passive. There's more to her passive, see two slime looking cubs, they are called fates, blue one is bad fate and red one is good fate. When Diadia blesses an ally with good fate or uses fate on an enemy, she earns an extra 20 gold and cuts the cooldown of her enhanced attack by 50%. This will really help her in teamfights as she will be able to use her enhanced basic attack more. More enhanced basic attack means more crowd control. First skill, two hearts. For Diadia's first skill, when she uses this ability, she marks an ally with good fate and heals them for next 5 seconds. If the marked heroes moves towards each other they will also get a movement speed boost. And also if they gets close they activates the good fate blessing, which heals teammates more than before, keeping speed boost for 2 seconds and she herself gains 20 golds. If Diadia casts the skill again on an ally who already has the mark, she rushes towards the target triggering good fate blessing. This not only heals the ally and boosts their speed but also heals Diadia herself. Another thing, if you don't cast the skill again within 5 seconds, the cooldown of this skill will be refreshed and you will be able to use it again. Second skill, complained about separation. When Diadia uses her second skill, she marks an enemy with fate revealing them for 5 seconds dealing magic damage. And most importantly she continuously takes away 2 gold coins from marked enemy for 5 seconds. This doesn't affect non-hero units like minions and jungle monsters. If marked enemies move towards each other, their movement speed will decrease. And if they gets too close to each other, fate resolve happens, which stops continuous damage and returns all the stolen gold at once. If she casts this skill again on the same enemy, she'll dash to the target. This will immobilize the target for one second and deals magic damage. During this time Diadia takes 25% less damage. Enemies can reclaim some of Diadia's stolen gold by defeating or getting an assist in defeating her. Just like her first skill, if she doesn't recast her second skill again within 5 seconds, second skill cooldown will reset. Ultimate Fate When Diadia uses her ultimate skill, she sends out a group of fate cubs forward in wide range. If the ultimate hits ally heroes, they gets good fate mark and heals them. But if enemies get hit by it, they will get marked with bad fate and get spell damage. And will also steal golds from all the marked enemies. If an ally already has good fate and gets hit by her ultimate, her first skill's bonus duration will get reset, giving them extra healing effects and speed boosts. On the other hand, if an enemy already has bad fate, her second skill's time will also reset dealing extra spell damage. Another important part of her ability is, every time Diadia earns an extra gold, her healing for ally heroes and spell damage to enemies from her ultimate increases by 1 points. So, basically it means, the more gold she steals the more damage her ultimate can do. Diadia is a very unique support hero. With her extraordinary abilities she can become a powerful asset to any team. She has everything, she can heal allies, increase movement speed, immobilize enemies and can also dish out decent damage. 
Her unique passive and her ultimate ability makes her even more powerful as she can steal gold from enemies. Here's her some build and arcana which will help after her release. So, are you guys excited about this hero? What's your thoughts on her? Let me know in comments below. That's it for today's video guys, hope you enjoyed it. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you in next video.